invaders are coming at us. Hold position. Waste them. Take what they've got. We won't go down without a fight. Hold on, citizen. We are here to help. Thank goodness. You came in the nick of time. Now the tides have turned. Get them! Wow, we won, but that was a close one. We should contact our rescuers ASAP, as they seem to be powerful factions. The raiders are gone for now, but the damage they left is severe. We need to start rebuilding right away. A city hall is a place where we will be making major decisions, so we should repair it first. Tired. As long as our residents are rested, upgraded, they will complete construction of buildings instantly. Upgrading buildings accumulates fatigue on your residents, making them not as efficient to run our settlement. Let's check the details. When your resident is vigorous, you are able to upgrade buildings, facilities, and craft equipments instantly. If your residents are tired, you are not able to upgrade buildings, but you can still upgrade facilities and craft equipments. Lastly, if you overwork your residents, they become exhausted. You have to wait till their fatigue recovers to continue your settlement expansion. Some coins or items will make your resident recover faster, but we can do that free when they are near. Vigorous residents are ready to work, but without resources, you cannot build up. Let's rebuild the farm to feed our residents. Seems the crops are growing well. Remember to harvest them every once Construction in a while. upgraded. Now that we Excellent. are safe from starving, let's build a generator to provide power. Generator is one of the facilities. Facilities are unlocked when their respective buildings reach certain levels. They offer major bonuses to our settlement. Like food, you should harvest often. Keep the settlement power. Construction upgraded. Good job on the rebuilding, boss. But aside of a lively settlement, we also need muscles when things get rough. Tap House is where we summon heroes from the wasteland, and it's now crowd-packed. Let's check inside. This is the basic summon, where you can summon uncommon, rare, and epic heroes. And this is the premium summon, where you can summon rare, epic, and legendary heroes. You get a free summon here every 24 hours. Now let's summon one. It seems you got a hero specialized in sniping. More info can be viewed in hero management. We will discuss how to manage our heroes soon. There are more urgent tasks now. See that vantage point over there? We should build a watchtower so we can be aware of our surroundings. Construction upgraded. Monsters incoming. We're under attack. Rally the militia. We got a home to protect. Bring the new recruit to battle formation and let's see what he's got to offer. This is where we fight! Our core unit, if it is destroyed, we lose the battle. Make sure to keep it safe. This is the enemy's core unit. Destroying it before they destroy ours is the key to the victory. The green bar is a health point of the unit. The unit is destroyed when it's reduced to zero. The orange bar is the rage. The unit will perform a powerful move when it's filled. Let's loot 
them. Battle increased the experience of our heroes. Our newbie did okay too. Let's check on all of them. Here's where we manage our heroes. This is the info of the hero. We can enhance them to make him stronger. Good. Enhancing the hero greatly increases his abilities. You can enhance him further and upgrade his skills later on. Heroes can be leveled up when enough EXP is accumulated. Leveling up a hero greatly increases leadership, allowing him to take more troops into battle. This is where we interact with major factions in the Wasteland. We need whatever help we can get in order to survive the harsh Wasteland. First, you need to choose one to befriend. Increasing reputation with the faction will lead to huge rewards from them. If you are not sure which is best, just select random and get an extra bonus. Of course, you can change the selection later. We got new orders. What can we do for you, sir? Let's rock! What can we do for you, sir? Good. Now we got faction at our back. Let's welcome our new friends and see what we got from them. Do you remember our core unit from the battle? This is where we can manage our core unit. Remember, core units are very important and can change the tide of battle. Awesome goodies! We got a gift from our new friend. Time for a ride! Great! Let's see it in action! We can use our watchtower to lure wandering monsters into our settlement. Nice. Let's stomp on some critters and get their loot. As our heroes leveled up, more troops can be put into their squad. Let's make them at full strength. We are more than able to defend our home now. Time to brave the wasteland. Are you ready? Let's roll. Gather resources and kill monsters in the wasteland to get whatever you need for your development. Join an alliance and claim territories to get huge bonuses. Bored by old-fashioned PvP battles? Besiege your enemies to wipe them off the map, or even intercept a moving troop. Fight for the pre-war technologies and become the ruler of the wasteland. you've learned the basics of surviving, the future of our settlement is in your hands. But I'll always be at your side as your advisor, providing info you might need. It's important to know the surroundings of the settlement, and radar helps a lot on that. Now, let's try to find a level 1 monster. Scanning. This is the radar. You can search targets here effectively. This is the radar radius. You can see all objects within this range. 